I have a project that I'm very, very passionate about. Um, it's called A Matter of Black Lives, Celebrating African American Fiddlers. Now, when I say that, most people go, oh God, you mean I have to sit through a whole hour and a half of fiddle music? Not. We're actually taking the violin, and you get a, a, the opportunity to hear the violin in a lot of different contexts. And the beauty is, it's not just me. It's my students from Frost, it's people that I, friends for years in the community. And it's kind of innovative in that the guy that inspired this whole thing is from Asheville, North Carolina. And he plays banjo and he blackfoot dances. Oh, don't ask me to do it. <laughs> and so I asked him, and I'm sure he thought I was out of my mind, I asked him to record himself dancing and playing banjo. And he did. And so we're going to play to him, all 13 of us are going to play to him dancing. I also have a young woman, young lady, I should say, she's 14 years old, and she's a traditional Irish dancer and an African-American tap dancer because, I'll tell you this really quickly, there's a place in New York called Five Points. And there's a, a point on Broadway now called Paradise uh, Square. Anyway, just wanted to tell me. And it's about this African-American uh, juba. His name was Master Juba. And he's an incredible dancer. And he was accepted by the poor Irish men in the same area because he could hit everybody but. Very simple. So I thought it would be great, and this is said by scholars, not by me, to be the origin of American captains. So the combination of the two. So why not? So I have a band, two dancers, um, and an assortment of fiddle players. This is free. It's Sunday too. I know they need to say something. It's free, open to the public. It's from three to five, and. If you want to know more, I'm going to give you my phone number. <laughs> All right? So you can text me or talk to me on a break. And anyway, we should play some music, right? That's what you came to hear.